What are the essentials for a DIY small space hydroponic system like the one behind me that's in my office? <laughs> Take a look and see. Be sure and watch to the end. Some things I DIY, some things I repurpose from around my house, and all of it I set up in a space that's two square feet for less than $50. You can use a clear egg carton and cotton balls. I do recommend a pH kit, pH balance kit. Reason being, our, you see the large size of pH down, that's because we use a lot of it. Our water is not good for leafy greens. Next up, some way to hold your seedlings as they grow. This is, you can use pumice stone or you can use Leka lightweight expanded clay pebbles. You will need an aerator, so you're going to need an air pump, tubing, and some type of air stone. You can make your own deep water culture tank. This is a food service tote with lid. You will need some type of net cups. I prefer the larger three inch net cups just so I have the flexibility of larger plants. Thought about not making this essential, but I have to tell you that <laughs> reusable zip ties is an essential for me. And you're going to need, yes, a grow light. Here are the tools you will need if you are ordering a kit, a deep water culture tank kit. You still will need these items. If you're not going DIY for seed starting, you will need a grow tray, preferably one with a dome. You will need a pH balance kit. And I would highly recommend that you purchase <laughs> seeds that are pelleted. Much, much easier to manipulate. Included in your DWC tank kit will be some clay pebbles, an air stone, tubing, and an aerator pump. You'll also receive the tank and net cups. Plus, some rock will cube as your seeding media. You will still need to purchase a grow light, and again, I'm highly recommending the zip ties. Like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and ring the bell so you'll know the next time I have more to share about hydroponics.